Hi, I'm Philippa Sue, and this is your Playbill Video First Look. The world of the play is contemporary play set in Washington with characters all struggling on their, in their intimate lives and in their ambitions and how to sort of be ambitious in an ethical way in today's world and how complicated that is. I mean, the reason why it's called The Vision Woman is based on a play from you know, the 1800s that it was a drawing room, sex, farce, comedy, and all the different things that he took and put it inside the world of Trump. But the reality is the play has you know, nothing to do with Trump. It's, it's just that we work within that world. I did the world premiere, South Coast Rep, now you know four years ago. And it was really after the 2016 election that Bo went in and changed the political surround. And what it did, because the stakes of the world got higher, it just really raised the stakes, like the personal stakes of every single character. In order to make it my own, uh, I needed to make some pretty drastic changes, so I got rid of certain characters, added new ones, changed huge elements of the story, and it kind of went from being an adaptation to something that was more inspired by uh, Beck's play. It'd be unfair to him to say it was an adaptation. Unfortunately, in many ways, civilization hasn't changed that much, so that's where the play works. It's an existential piece. It's about the human condition. And we have, um, we have the political climate of the time, uh, which makes it that much more relevant and that much more important. The real thing about the play is people trying to find their way, whether it's for good, like to try to do good things for the people, which is what government's supposed to do, or whether it's for personal gain, wealth, power, whatever. So you see these five characters all trying to negotiate that. What I hope the play does is it steers people towards asking the right questions about our relationships, about our society, and, and how do we you know, put our best foot forward in, in moving forward. There certainly are elements uh, that, that may bear some resemblance to House of Cards within the play because I'm me and I, I write the way I write. Uh, but but uh, fundamentally, at the core of the story is a character unlike any that you've seen in House of Cards. A lot of it comes down to Uma and Pam, these two you know, forces of obviously Pam having the career that she has, but Uma coming into this experience mostly from film and just being fearless with it and just raw and wild. You need a really charismatic person to step into that role, and that is Uma. That is Uma Thurman. I mean, she's an incredibly smart, incredibly well-read, um, incredibly charismatic person, and that that translates. I feel that this is the greatest challenge of my career. Um, I think this is the perfect play for me, so it is my best shot um, to set my first foot on Broadway.